Apostle Dr. Kwejo Safo, for the past 33 years, has always championed the cause of Ghanaian inventors with his inventions, but which have not been very commercially successful. He has always invented products that are yet to hit the market. The announcement that Apostle Safo is going into commercial production of his latest inventions have been hailed as good news. On display at the 33rd edition of his exhibition included a 4x4 cross-country vehicle named Kantanka on 94, which is ignited by a walking stick. The walking stick is raised and pointed at the vehicle, then ignition starts. <laughs> Both the interior and the exterior of the car is as sophisticated as any other four-wheel drive. When the car's gear is set to reverse, an automated voice issues a safety warning to those close by. Another of his vehicle inventions is the electronic saloon car, powered by 13 car batteries, making it environmentally friendly. It also has a cozy and spacious interior and the reverse attributes of the O94. Perhaps one, if not the most interesting invention of this edition of the exhibition, is the Kantanka prototype aircraft with a rocket launcher and a bazooka. This is a demonstration of how it works. Another is the defense robot which is expected to ensure the security of a particular post or area. Without the approved pass, you will not be allowed to enter or access the post or anything related to the secured area. This is a smoke detector which will indicate the exact position of a possible fire outbreak. The sensor detects the smoke, then relays it to the motherboard, which also simultaneously gives out the information in the form of spoken word. Don't be confused by this tricycle rider. It is not a zoom line rider, but a prototype sanitation robot. It goes round collecting litter on the streets. There is also an electric changeover switch. These engine blocks and spare parts were all molded by the Apostle. By end of May 2014, you might be seeing some of these inventions on the market and perhaps boost investor confidence in our local inventors and innovators. Imanolante, reporting for Joy News in Accra.